Hey guys, so uh, Brawl Stars dropped a mysterious picture on their social media pages a couple days ago without saying anything about it, right? Um, now, <laughs> you guys know that I have a direct means of communication with Ryan and with Brawl Stars, and normally Ryan will tell Supercell YouTubers and stuff like uh, what's going on beforehand and stuff like that, but they have not told us anything. They have not said a single thing about that picture, okay? Now, a lot of the other YouTubers, they put some stuff out that have been like really positive. They're like, hey, it could be a 5v5 game mode. They, oh, by the way, I'm, this is the middle of the night for me. <laughs> I'll, get, I'll get to that. They've been really positive. They're just like, hey, this, maybe this is global. Maybe, you know, they're like, oh, it could be killing the game. I don't know. It could be global. It could be like a, a 5v5 mode or something like that. I haven't really felt super great about it, which is why I haven't said anything. Um, and like I said, guys, they have not said anything to us, anything. So I don't like the fact that they haven't been talking to us about that. I mean, I know that we get more communication than you guys do. So I, I can't imagine how you guys feel, but like for real, like that's that's nerve wracking for me. So yeah, middle of the night, I am, I was just up take, taking care of baby Cairo. So was just feeding her and, um, and Finland, their work day has started. Okay, work day has started. So I'm like, okay, well, I got to go check out, see if they've said anything because they haven't communicated with us. And so I look for their <laughs> Twitter and I find nothing. Okay, not like, not nothing like a lack of an update, like nothing. It's, it's gone. All posts from Brawl Stars' official Twitter have been deleted. It's all gone. Okay, so my heart's like sinking at this point. I'm like, okay, frick, like what's going on here? Um... So I go ahead and take a look at their Facebook page. Their Facebook page doesn't even exist. It just says, what does it say here? It says, sorry, this content is, isn't available. <laughs> I don't know. So I'm freaking out. My heart's like, heart's like pounding. My mind is racing. It's all gone. It's all gone. And I'm thinking they decided to kill it. <laughs> they decided to kill Brawl Stars. I can't believe it. I, I can't. I, I can't. I don't, I don't know what to think. I know that it looks like I'm happy right now. Like my face is smiling. I just don't know what to say. <laughs> I am shocked. My heart, I am, I am. This sucks. <laughs> and I don't know how to handle it. Hello fellow brawlers, I'm Kairos Time, and it's time to brawl, possibly for one of the last times. Um, okay. I can't believe that I'm doing this in the middle of the night. This is so crazy. This is hard, this is a really hard video to make, guys. Um, obviously I put a ton of effort into my channel, and if Brawl Stars gets killed, that's gonna suck. That's gonna be really, that's gonna be really awful. I don't have gameplay for you, I'm sorry, I don't have anything recorded. I wanted to get this out to you guys as soon as I possibly could, so it's just me talking. Now, I don't want I don't want people to panic. I don't know. We still haven't. We don't know 100% what's going on. I'm kind of panicking because like for most of you guys that are watching, like this is a game and that's fun and cool, but like I've I've spent a lot of time and effort onto this and if they I don't know if I'll keep doing YouTube. I just don't even know. Like I mean, I guess I did just do like Storm Arena yesterday or today or whatever, and that's been actually a lot of fun. So I don't know. I don't know. But before I say anything, it's really important that you guys know that nothing has been confirmed. They have not 100% said the Brawl Stars is going to be killed. It just really looks like it. But still, no official word has actually been said or anything like that. Now, today's video, I'm going to be talking um, about everything that I know about what's going on as well as some speculation of what, what could possibly happen, okay? And before we actually get into that, I, I really... <laughs> I really don't want this game to be killed, guys. So I'm going to ask for your help, okay? Please, please, please support the hashtag don't kill Brawl Stars movement, okay? Hashtag don't kill Brawl Stars. Flood it anywhere where Supercell might see it, okay? On Reddit, on Twitter, on Facebook, on, on Clash Royale's page, on Clash of Clans, is whatever you can do. Um, tell your friends, tell your bandmates, put it in your in your in your band descriptions whatever just tell your favorite youtubers get them on board like we have to spread the word guys we we cannot let supercell do this and i mean it's their decision but if anything we can at least show them that we care and that we don't want this to happen and 
if anything, maybe they'll at least like reconsider killing the game or something like that. So that's what we're gonna. That's what I'm gonna. I'm gonna start off with that. Please, please support that once again. Hashtag Don't Kill Brawl Stars. <laughs> you can add a please on there. <laughs> Whatever it takes. Okay, now we're gonna talk about everything that we know, and I'm also gonna share my own speculations. Now, before I tell you guys what everybody knows. I, I talked things over with Lex. He decided he's going to share some of this information on his channel. And we probably shouldn't share this. Like, like we've both signed Supercell non-disclosure agreements. So we're not allowed to say things um, in, that has been shared with us privately from Supercell out to the public without their permission. But Lex decided that he was going to. And I, I was really hesitant. But he said, he, you know, he's going to. So I'm like, okay, I, we, I mean, at least we can. I mean, if they kill the game, like. I'm not planning on covering other other Supercell games. Um, like if I I don't know what I would do. I just don't. So I don't really feel like I have very much to risk. I mean, I guess they could sue us. I I, I they better not sue us. I I don't think they'd sue us. I I hope. Okay, so this is information that only Lex or I could actually share with you. Last time we were in Finland, Ryan let us know some information, some inside information. Okay. And he was very serious in letting us know that they still did not know if Brawl Stars was going to go global or not. Now, that's not really like a biggie, right? Like they've they've been saying that for over a year, you know, since since the game was first released. They've always said, we don't know. We don't know. We have no idea. We don't know. We just are doing the best. But and that that's fine. But here's where things get really scary, where they get time sensitive. OK, when we were filming Brawl Talk. We recorded a segment where I asked Ryan specifically if we would have a time, not not when it was going to go global, but if there was a time when we would know if the game was going to be going global or it was going to be killed. And Lex and I were shocked because Ryan actually answered us. He was he answered us. And I was like, what? He said that by the end of this year, we would know if they were going to kill the game or we were going to release the game. Now, if you're looking at your calendar, you're thinking, hey, it's it's almost the end of the year. Like, it the time is now. Like, they they have to have made a decision by now. Now, um, we were really excited about this. Lex and I, we were freaking out. We were like, oh my gosh, we're gonna know. It's gonna happen. Like, we were we were just like, hey, the Brawl Stars is gonna go global by the end of the year or like soon after the end of the year because because of that time frame, like we were just stoked and we were really excited for our viewers to know that and for that to actually be released on Brawl Talk, but it never made the final cut. For whatever reason, they took it off of that Brawl Talk. Like, for real, they just they just took it off. And Ryan didn't tell us why or anything like that. I, I, I it's, it's kind of an intense phrase so I can understand why, but I don't even know what to say, guys. This sucks. <laughs> What's even worse is that or what makes this even more real is that we then later had a private conversation with Ryan. We were like, stoked, hey, we're, we're going to know when, like, what? what's the plan? What are you guys going to do? And Ryan said, okay, well, we do have a solid plan if we do want to release the game go, uh, globally. But we also do have a very real plan on what we're going to do if we're going to kill the game. And honestly, at the time, like, Lex and I were just like, sweet, sounds good. They're going to, you know, it wasn't even a concern for us. But now I'm just like, this is the plan. The plan was to to delete everything off of social media or something like I don't know. They'll, they'll probably probably what will end up happening is they'll let the content creators say, I don't know um, when previous games were killed. They did do it via Twitter. So they may just like delete everything and then just like do a post or something. I don't know if I were you guys, I would absolutely follow Brawl Stars as Twitter. You can't find their Facebook page. So at least follow on Twitter and figure that out so that if we do hear something, then you'll know. And of course, if I know anything, then I'll tell you guys as soon as I possibly can. Some of you guys are going to be asking, why would they just kill this game? Like, it's a it's a really good game. If anything, it's at least decent. I was watching a lot of those other speculation videos from other YouTubers and stuff um, from, in response to that mysterious picture that, was, that they posted on Twitter. And everybody seems pretty positive that Supercell wouldn't kill Brawl Stars because it is a good game. But remember, guys... Supercell are they are game killers. They've killed games before. They Smashland was one of them and there were people that Smashland was like one of their favorite games ever and they still killed it. Like Supercell doesn't just release good games, okay? They release amazing games. 
And they're not going to release Brawl Stars unless they do consider that to be amazing. Now, here's where things get really kind of kind of scary. Um, and I really, I really should not be sharing this with you. Ryan let us know some other inside information. And that is that, first of all, the, the, masses, the massive success that Clash Royale had um, made Supercell set an incredibly high bar for their game, really high standards, because Clash Royale just kind of like blew everything out of the water. And um, it just took over the leaderboards on all um, game stores and things like that. Like it, it was just incredible. And so Supercell... Um, has that really high expectation. And Ryan let us know that Brawl Stars has never reached that bar set by Clash Royale. Not even once. Okay, even 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 after landscape update where things did get better, like retention rates and stuff, Brawl Stars didn't reach that. It, it just didn't. And on top of that, guys, now it's, this wasn't from Ryan, but I can almost guarantee you that Brawl Stars is not making as much money as, as uh, Clash Royale is, okay? Or in, in comparison, um, the 1.5 years that it takes for you to max out your account on Brawl Stars is laughable in comparison to the 20 plus years that it takes to max out a Clash or a Clash Royale account for free. So that's another big thing. And they are a company. They have to they have to look at that bottom line of actual money. So then the other question that people are going to bring up is the fact that Clash or Brawl Stars, um, that the Supercells put a lot of time and effort and money into Brawl Stars. So why why would they kill a game that they put so much money and effort into so for so long? First of all, I'm pretty much get, like I'm I'm convinced that Supercell has unlimited amounts of money, <laughs> so I don't think money is their concern, okay? In fact, one of the mantras that Supercell stands by is that um, they put all possible time and effort and energy and all of their resources into an idea to make it the best idea possible and then decide whether to get rid of it or not. And if it's not good enough, it doesn't matter how much money they put into it, they kill it. And that's because Supercell's main resource or their most valuable resource isn't money their most valuable resource is people and they have incredibly amazing people working on brawl stars and if brawl stars isn't as amazing as the people are that are working on it then they want to take they will, they'll kill brawl stars and put those people on other projects that will help them to further progress the success of Supercell in cre creating absolutely amazing games. They'd rather scrap a game that was decent in order to keep those people from having to spend the rest of their careers working on the same game. <sighs> My face is getting hot from this. Like, I can't even handle this. Now, with all of this being said, it's still not 100% certain that they are going to kill the game, okay? There's still a chance that they could just, like, decide, hey, yep, you know what, this is, this, they're going to be releasing the game globally. I, it's, I seriously hope, I hope this is the case. Like, other than probably the, the Brawl Stars developers, I've invested more time and energy than most anybody regarding with Brawl Stars, and I, I have a lot writing on it. Honestly, I would really love to make a career out of YouTube uh, and creating YouTube videos. And if Brawl Stars got killed, I don't know that I would have the energy to just jump onto another game. I mean, it's scary, but it's true that I don't know that there's another game out there that I could be passionate about like I am with Brawl Stars at the moment. Like, I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't even like Fortnite. <laughs> I mean, that's really scary for me, but it's true. And that's, I have to look at the facts and the facts are really convincing. Brawl Stars just removed everything from social media. And I cannot imagine that that's a good thing. We also don't have voice acting on almost half of the brawlers in the game. And the last I remember, the Brawl Stars de developer team, their goal was to try and like completely change the, re the 3D models of each of the brawlers. That's why they redid Mortis and got rid of his hat. They did that so that they could actually make skins faster for these brawlers if the game went global and I'm pretty sure they've only done like a fourth of the brawlers like there's a ton of work that is left to do and time is kind of running out also we know that Brawl Stars has not performed to Supercell standards in the past uh, and I cannot imagine that they've improved that that dramatically at least like they've they've improved I'm sure it's gotten better like I'm continuing to grow uh, in subscribers and stuff on on my channel so there's got to be some growth but I don't know if there's enough I'm really sorry guys I know that this is kind of a rant this is just kind of like all hitting me right now when I felt like I had to talk about it I uh, you guys will have to let me know what you think about it in the comment section this is insane this is insane 
I just, I just don't. I, I can't. I don't know. Please, please just do whatever you can to try and spread the movement, the hashtag don't kill Brawl Stars movement. Please, guys. I, like, if you love this game, please. If you love me, if you want to see my channel do well, just spread it. Spread it around, guys. I mean, I don't think that they're just going to, like, straight up kill it, like, immediately. Like, I think that they would at least, like, let the servers run for a couple months or something like that and let people, like, have their last hurrahs. So I don't think there's, like, any rush. But at the same time, it really looks like it's coming up. I don't, I really just don't even know what's going to happen. Um, for now, this is Kairos time ticking by. <laughs> I just got a little emotional about my, my ending phrase. Ticking by. This is Kairos time ticking by, guys. Uh, and we will... I hope we'll see you. <laughs>